I don't remember where everything is. I got lucky I managed to pull off the last three times. <clears throat> Alright, let's see if my control scheme still doesn't ruin me. Alright, speaking of which, because my control scheme is all I can't figure out where to put grab, we're also going to make it this button and this button. The reason for that is that way I can grab with my right hand. So I can actually get myself ready. Oh! You have to aim them upwards. They don't just go upwards. Alright. Hey, Birdo. Was there anything up here? Nope. That's really cool if I just hold up it climbs. I like that. Oh, great. You again. Well, well, I didn't expect to see you up here. I'm glad you're still in one piece. I see you made it through the hotel. Did you meet Mr. Oshiro? Well, I met him, all right. He chased me out of there. I have to clean up a bunch of junk for him. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that sounds like a fun morning. Oshiro is a lot soul, dear. That place is much more than just a hotel to him. Don't make him your project. You know what I think? I think this mountain drove both of you crazy. You know? You're not the first person to say that. <laughs> Maybe you're right. Hold on, if I were crazy. The way I see it, the mountain can't bring out anything that isn't already in you. But you gotta have a few crows short of a murder to live up here in the first place, right? By the way, how did she get all the way over here? Like, we had to fight our way up. What are you even talking about? Oh, I'm just rambling like the old bat I am. Are you ready to give up? I know a shortcut back to your car. Alright, so she has a shortcut. That's good to know. Back off, lady. I'm heading for the summit. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference between stubbornness and determination, ain't it? That's true. That is so true. You remind me of myself when I was young. Good luck, and mind the wind! Oh, she still has more to say. You don't get many visitors up here, do you? No, I can't say I do. I don't mind the solitude, though. Sometimes I think I should live in solitude, too. Not everyone can live in slope, dude. I really tried to get through to Mr. Oshiro. I wanted to help him. Oshiro needs to move on from that hotel. But it's not gonna happen on your schedule. And it doesn't help that you've got something to prove. Yep. Don't you get lonely in that little cabin? Ah, friends, dear. I may be crazy, but I'm not a hermit. Sorry. I didn't mean to assume. When I was younger, I couldn't imagine staying in one place for this long. But then I found this mountain. I knew right away that this would be my home. What's so special about it? The mountain shows you who you really are. Whether you're ready for it or not. It keeps me honest. That's something. Be able to know who you are at all times is... So that a lot of people don't have. Yep, can't really go up there, and there's nothing up there. All right, gotta say the wind that pushes against you is my least favorite fair mechanic. I like how you distinguish between mechanics that are fair versus mechanics that aren't fair. Because I'm assuming any mechanic that isn't fair isn't a mechanic you enjoy. I'm gonna make that assumption. Then again. Define it as a fair or unfair mechanic is perhaps part of it? I just want to make sure that there's nothing else on that screen. I guess not, because it's not my main stick there. Mm. I know you can dash to go that faster, I just was like, letting it happen. There we 
here. What happened? Heck yes. Getting used to all the... So I haven't played it in like a speedrun style, so I'm trying to get used to all the speedrun style mechanics. Need to hit the other side, then dash off a bit. All right. Just getting used to it. Oh well, yeah, I could just I could just use grab. I could just use grab. I swear, grab is the last thing I consider. It's not good that's the last thing I consider. Ah, the Golden Ridge. Glad you enjoy this. This is definitely... This is actually one of my favorite stages of the... Starting stages. Scott. I know what I'm doing, I just... You know what? I gotta actually start using Grab. That's what I gotta start doing. There we are. Favorite gameplay, chapter six maybe? Hmm. I will say, the chapter where you get the second dash is definitely a lot of fun, gameplay-wise. And like, story-wise, of course, the chapter where you, the chapter where you fight battle in. That's not always going to make it, so let's just take it the safe route. Alright, so I was trying to go to the... It seems like there's something over to the right there. Or to the left there. Ooh, Ooh strawberry. Oh yeah, that's not a possibility. So you definitely have to start with this one, because the wind starts after you pick it up. Uh, I'm trying to get the strawberry, but... Alright. So, I don't resonate with this game's story. Luckily enough, the gameplay and music is tight. Meanwhile, the other person. I really like almost every chapter, including B-sides. I sort of don't like the core that much, but we all know very well. And I do resonate with the game story myself. Um, Definitely, like, the core stacks mechanics were definitely interesting. Um... I don't think anyone felt too hot about the fire mode core, but the cold mode is where it's at. Okay. I don't know. They just seem like they were perfect. Like, they ha one has to come with the other. It, like, it wasn't that I, like, when I think of the core, I don't think of fire side and cold side. I just think of the core. All right. I'm trying to think, how do I... There we are. Oh my gosh. But yeah, this story, if it resonates with you, okay, I just, I can just dash over to that side. Okay, got it. I think I got it. Now it's just implementation. Oh my gosh. All right. There we are.
Hey. Control sometimes. Alright, what do we got for us? Alright. Okay. I gotta use X more instead of up for the grabs. There we go. Alright. Got B side. that the wind was coming a little faster. Oh, wait. Don't want to use it until... So. Awesome. Ooh. Hey, Tadpole. How's it going? I don't have much time today, but I come to congratulate on you on the word rec world record, because hard work pays off. Thank you, hater. Thank you. Thank you, man. Glad to see ya. Okay, I have an idea. Get the second one. So we just do this. And we wait for it to come back. Uh, the idea works, at least. Nope, nope. We're gonna do that so I don't have to wait around twice. Oh, duh, I have a... Technically, I could do this in two different routes with... Grabbing that and then the other. Oof. Don't worry, I'm coming back for the strawberries, sire. Don't you worry. Yeah, I recognize I could lower it. Definitely... Realize that afterwards. Oh, I don't know about lowering it under the screen itself. Let's see, what we got for us? Oh. Oh. Not much of a... Thanks for the heads up anyways, but not necessary. All right, this one, I think we actually enter from above and we go below, if I'm correct. There we are. Let's see two strawberries. Um, what do you think about the game's music? Dude, so I'm not much of a judge of music. But I know when a good when there's good music. I know when there's good music, even when I don't have skill of. I'm not very musically inclined, but I know when there's good music. So, and this is good music. So, is this our next speedrunning game? This and Hades are the two games I'm looking to speedrun. So yes, actually. Yes, actually. Oh. Oh, it walls it off when you've got everything. Cool. 
I'm assuming that path to the right is the correct direction. Yep. Oop. One of my favorite games is one I've never I'd never speedrun though, sadly. Yeah, no, there's there's some games that you just can't speedrun. Um like imagine having your favorite game be Sit Sit the Sif series. Like there's somebody who could do that. Do definitely need to learn the speedrunning strats themselves, but definitely want to at least get started on this. Alright. Oh, it's just not the kind of game you'd speedrun. Alright. Alright. So this one, I can't believe I forgot when I was playing this as a kid. But yeah, if you hold down you fall through. That's just a common Mario mechanic. Like, everyone knows about this. Or everyone should know. Whew. Alright. The Mario 3 Easter egg. Yep. Yeah. By the way, you can share what your favorite game is. I'm just like, I'm letting you keep privacy if you'd like. That's... Was I sw It looked like I was swimming up... Okay, nah. Okay. Okay. Oh, I had time. Awesome. Just doing stupid things and getting stupid results. As one does. I thought for sure that was where the other entrance was. So this is up there too, alongside In Inkenfell. So do you think the light run, aka any percent or more? I'm gonna, I'm gonna just. So I'm gonna just start with um, any percent and like work my way into the others, and just get myself used to the different categories. Basically, is this one? I know there's one of these where. You destroy the block, and it's uh, on the other side. Ooh. So you see you got speed red farewell first. Um, bad controller or bad player? Um, the player created the controller that you're looking at, so bad player. Oh, that's not how you grab that berry. It also doesn't feel like how you grab that berry, though. Ah. Uh, concept down. This execution. Don't jump. Alright, we're just gonna climb back up. Let's try to get past the spikes. Oop. There's something up here. Nope. Uh, I tried to play farewell. I surrender to the great power of advanced settings. Yep. Sis mode, man. I'm sure, it shoved other people there. And yes, I never beat um, it 
I never be um, farewell, so that's definitely a goal that we're going to be hunting for during this run. Oof. I'd watch the garbage of a farewell stream. Well, I'll make sure that when I do farewell, it just takes the entire stream. So, though, be warned, I am not a very salty boy. So, I'd be a little disappointed in that. Just jump. Just jump. I don't like doing salt. I was trying to refresh my dash as I kept going, but steak. Can't even say that. Yep. You must be going for YouTube kids. I'm not going for YouTube kids, but there's no reason. So here's the theme. Cuss words have power because you never say them. Because they are a rare occasion. If I start saying cuss words, then they start losing losing their power when I use them. Like if, you know, if a teacher says a cuss word, pe all the kids look in shock. All the people watching that art kids still um, feel like, oh my gosh, something happened. So. I'm not the. I will not devalue the power of a cuss word. Um. From there. Immediately. <laughs> Almost. I mean, I guess I have. I, it, I do have salt. I'm not gonna deny that. The thing is. I try to avoid the rage gaming. Rage gaming is very much. I am opposed to the. Um. Advertising through it sort of thing. You know? Like, people that um, are known as rage gamers, I do not wish to be one of those people, ever. I thought I grabbed. Mm, oh well. Whoop. Although I believe with enough practice, anybody could do it, but I didn't put enough time in it. Stop saying curse words, guys! It's illegal and it's violent! If you say cuss words, you go to jail! If you say cuss words in jail, then you will only eat broccoli! Broccoli tastes good, man. No issue with only eating broccoli. Hmm. But yeah, no, you don't go to jail. I just... It's a personal... There's a personal reason why I don't, um... Use cuss words. And, like, you can't make cuss words great again if you just throw them out like they're any other words. So, like, sure, if you want to joke around saying, make cuss words great again, by all means, the way you make them great is by giving them power again. And you give them power by not using them in situations where they're not needed. I mean, if I'm quoted saying that broccoli tastes good, by all means. Like, that's one of the things that I'll have on my tombstone. I, I mean, I'd rather not die with that, but, like... <laughs> Alright! That one! <laughs> I remember that. Um, so, that was, um... <laughs> So Zippy wasn't... So... <laughs> oh my gosh. Um... So, that was actually, um... Sly Cheddar that said all the cuss words. But, so basically, I have... So I did... I do some, um, technical meeting streams with some of my D&D club people. And some of them have cuss word issues. So I didn't want people to, like, come in thinking this was child-friendly because... Generally, I am a little child-friendly. 
but I knew they were going to cuss. I'm like, you know what? Let's just get it out of the way now. So I just told them to cuss right off the bat to get rid of it. <laughs> and, <laughs> uh, that's hilarious. Yeah, no, so there was that one stream where I'm just like, all right, this is for adults. Cheddar, just start cussing so I can just, just cuss. I only wanted to cuss once. I just kept going and we're like, oh God, Cheddar, stop. <laughs> uh. Straight shot. Next time. I right, gotta jump off of that. Whew. Have a good one, hater. Glad for you to show up as long as you did. Do I just have to shoot straight? Probably. <laughs> Sludge at her. Beep, beep, beep. Yep, that was basically what happened. Oh, that's a rock. Beautiful. That put me upwards. That's awesome. That doesn't feel like... It feels like that's, um... See, it's supposed to be a little further forward. Whew. Good podcast. Hand and off... Had an offhand spoiler to Curse of Straw, but otherwise was informative. Glad to hear it. I do that more for, like, the D&D &D group. Um, but, yeah. I'm just not grabbing on right. Alright, because I have to hold the direction I want to grab on to. But I like the path that I'm doing when I do it properly, that is. Keep thinking I'm grabbing on, but not registering properly. There we are. So glad I added up as a climb function, because sometimes I just want to hold. Yeah, I think this is the one where it's behind. Awesome. Nope. What's the toughest strawberry in the game? I have no idea. I'm assuming we're not counting golden strawberries, because that's kind of cheating. I have no idea. I'll have to figure out as we go. I'll tell you when we get a strawberry that's in the running. Yep. Makes sense. Moonberry. Yeah, the thing is, I'm like arguing that golden strawberries, moonberry, the moonberry, like, those ones aren't really in the running because they're not traditional strawberries my argument. I feel like I might have missed a strawberry by doing that way. Had a feeling. Yeah. Alright, so we're going from here, down, there, up, up. Alright, so we're just kind of following the path. Moonberry, there's a secret exit um, in the uh, farewell, and when you get through that secret exit, the Moonberry is the result. So that's what that is. 
Sure it doesn't change the end screen, but that's because it's chapter 9 after the end screen. Right in between. I was trying to get myself. I watch speedruns. I am a speedrunner. I like watching speedruns, so I've seen people speedrun the Moonberry. still, but one of the tough berries, looks like. Snowballs, right. Game audio is a little loud. Let's see. Music. There we are. Hopefully that fixes it. Tell me if you need any other change. If you need the just fits to continue. Another game and you are about the same volume. All right, that's fine. I can accept that. Well, just for the sake. Turn it about there. There we are. Some people are rocking out to the music, so I don't want to turn it too low. I do want to be heard, but I don't want to turn it down too low. Duh, you just come the other direction. You just come from the other side. That's... I'm trying to do this whole snowball tech. Just... Just approach from the other side. Here. Yeah, you told me after... You... You know the comment after I figured it out. But thank you for the assistance. 
All right, just straight. Every time, speed boost is too much for me to handle. There we go. Keep it going. Me and my never climbing nature. Hmm. I'm coming actually got to you after you figured it out. I said before I saw you figure it out. Yep. Go. Pop, 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 pop. Great, beautiful. Every time I try to use that dash to speed things up. I feel like there is a strawberry here that I miss a lot. Oh well. Not how you do that. Just go with the flow. Just go with the flow. When dashing technically slows your character down. Could definitely be interesting in areas. I do, I do like the wind as a concept. It's just the random stops definitely make it harder than it needs to be. Off times. Woo. Just gotta not do stupid things like that. All right, here we are. Good story moment. Madeline, wait up! Whew. Ram stops without good reaction type feels like BS. Yep. Nailed it! <clears throat> Theo, are you all right? Oof, yeah. Just give me a sec. There's only like two sections that are that bad. Fair enough. Hey, a gondola! I've always wanted to ride one of these. No, it looks pretty old, but maybe it still works? I don't see any other way to cross this chasm. Let's do it! <clears throat> this lever looks important. Easy every time. I was probably a gondola operator in our past life. Do you think this lead is safe? I'm sure it's fine. How'd you shake out with Hoshiro? You were right. I shouldn't have tried to help him. I hate to say I stole you so, but... Yeah, yeah. I should have listened to you. You didn't get hurt. That's what matters. The air is so thin up here. By the way, with a... You don't get hurt. Honestly, wasting so much time on someone, that hurts emotionally. Like, glad that you didn't get hurt physically, but emotionally, like, spade so much time on someone like that, only for them to falter, only for them to, for it to be nothing. It hurts emotionally. I'm just gonna state that. So, just because you don't see the hurt doesn't mean they ain't hurt. I can barely breathe. Okay, if we don't get a selfie on this thing, we're going to regret it. <laughs> I can't even see the ground through the mist. <coughs> I can't even see the ground through the mist. Honestly, in a gondola like this, the last thing I'd want to do is see the ground. How high up are we? Less panicking, more posing.
What was that? <laughs> Looks like we stalled out. This is really bad. Maybe if I... Yep, beautiful. Well, that's not good. No, oh, this really isn't good. Madeline, you cool? No, I'm not cool. I can't breathe. You're having a panic attack. Why would you think this is a good idea to ride this stupid thing? Come on, don't take this out on me. Stay with me here. My grandpa taught me a trick for this. Close your eyes. Picture fle a feather floating in front of you. See it? Okay. By the way, good job on everyone's visual cues. It's impressive. That feather, you guys are imagining it so well that I could see it too. Well done, everyone. Well done. <clears throat> Your breathing helps keep the feather floating. Just breathe slow and steady in and out. <clears throat> Alright, there he is. It's kind of weird. It's not the pace that I'm used to. I'm like, just keeping it centered like this. It takes work. Alright. Huh. <laughs> See? Easy every time. <sighs> what do you mean by, are you Madeline, sire? If you're talking about just, like, the story, or, like, just character stuff feeling any better I, I think so thanks for helping me calm down how did you know we'd start moving again oh I totally thought we were done for <laughs> sometimes you gotta play it cool when you're in those situations cuz panicky totally just gonna make it worse look at the selfie though Uh, uh, you were saying Madeline was probably emotionally hurt from her encounter with Ashira. Okay, so, this stuff. So, might as well just say it out loud. But, yeah, with um, the story of Celeste, is that it's a story of a person going through depression, going through troubles, dealing with other people that are going through troubles and stuff like that. And I've had a life. I'm 26, I've had a life, man. Not the longest life, but I've dealt with some of that stuff. I have a, I have a member of the family that is my Oshiro, basically. <sighs> spent a lot, spent a lot, entire summer that was lost. Oh well, but anyways, yeah, I understand a lot of the story because I've experienced it in my own way. Is a way of saying it. So, a lot of people have. This is why the story is so huge because it resonates with a lot of people that have gone through. This similar hardships. Let's put it that way. Definitely, you could feel it. Alright, so how many did I miss this time? Alright, I missed four. I can accept four misses. But we got B-side, we got heart. 